welcome to qualifying in Spain Grand Prix. We are here and qualifying gets underway with 2 minutes and 40 seconds left on the clock while we are last position with Degrassi in front of us. For the past few races, we barely even make it to the top 10 shootout. Can we show our best performance this weekend in Spain? At Catalonia Grand Prix into the first sector with a minus 0 0.5 seconds off the clock and we are slightly faster than our teammate Lucas Di Grassi. So we are right now low on fuel and it's been a pretty tough race for us. Getting out a good exit from the corner not touching that curb or maybe slightly using that curb a little for a good exit and heavily braking going into the final sector so this is a tricky corner as cars usually have low traction control over here and into a right hander braking zone and then the left hander followed by a right hander so it's easy to corner cut at that sector over there and the final corner we go and let's see how well we can get 20th place As race gets underway with Sebastian Vettel heading pole with Mark Webber, his teammate behind him, Fizzers in 21st, while Degrassi is sadly last again. Five flights off, and here we go into the Spain Grand Prix. We have not gotten a good start as Chandok has already overtaken us with Senna behind ready to overtake us anytime. However, the first corner was clean without any touching. We finally overtook Chandok and got our position back from the start. And with Jano truly in front ahead of us for the overtaking. This track seems to have a high tire wear and we are on the hardest compound tyre oh wow slightly sliding and missing truly over there that's very very dangerous and Barricolo has spun over there into the final corner we go with yellow flags waving no overtaking so we are still 21st into lap 3 Oh, we have lost control of the car and we have spun into the gravel. We have gone slightly missing barricade over there, and yellow flex is out. Seems like Fizz has lost control of the car for a moment, and it's very, very, very dangerous for him to do that because he might just co collect barricade along with him. And into lap 4 we go. And here we go again. As soon as that team order came in, we hit Degrassi from the front. So our wheels touched each other and he spun. So seems like now a good time for the team radio message. And let's take a look at the replay of the start. I apologize for the shaky camera because of Codemasters, however they seem to have improved in the latest games. And here you can see Chando overtaking us with Senna behind us, ready to overtake, ready to pounce any time. And we move to the left, overtaking Chandok in the first corner. However, we did make the move stick after the second corner. And into the hairpin we go. And as you can see here, we are getting very close to truly. 
So here you can see how we lost control of the car and we skidded letting Chan dog through and Senna hit us from the back and he spun as well. So into lap 6, into lap 7 right now. So we are still 23rd position. Lap 8, still 23rd, we have not improved. And time for a pit stop. Changing into the softer compound of the tyres. So seems like we can get a clean pit stop right now because there ain't any cars behind us. But for the previous race, our pit stop was not clean as it was like 13 seconds apart from the usual 3 to 4 seconds. A clean pit stop as it's 5.5 seconds from the Virgin Pit crew. We are in last position. Seems like we are not making any good progress this weekend as we have not done any overtaking and we are still last position. And the other cars are very far ahead from us. So it seems like we have to stick with the final position. Blue flex. And Fizzer finishes the race in lap 12 in last position.